Finney Suns giving us an unbelievable run this year and this upcoming season. You can turn the Suns in four into an actual bet. So Gibby, Tess, and Mark are all inside the Footprint Center, home of your Phoenix Suns, uh, where you can obviously catch some other games this weekend, too. What's up, guys? Hey, you know, here's the thing, right, Scott? Uh, when you think about this only being the second in the country, the first in the state, we've been telling you about sports books all morning long, mm -hmm. Tess. We're finally going to get a chance to show them what yes. one looks like if no one knows what we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, this is actually the only one that's officially open right now. So let's go on in. Mike's going to lead the way. This is FanDuel's newest sports book opening up here at the Footprint Center. And it's an exciting day. It officially opens this afternoon, but it is already open for business. As you can see, lots of folks here. And jo uh, Jeff is joining us right now with FanDuel to talk a little bit about what you can expect when you walk in. This is a beautiful place. Thank you very much. We're super excited to open here today. Uh, it's a historic day for Arizona, legalizing sports betting and, and getting us up and running today. So couldn't be more excited. So when you come down, uh, what you can expect is a world-class sports betting experience, and that's what we strive to, pro to provide for customers. My next question was going to be, dare I say, Vegas who? Because the way you have this set up as Mike walks around and takes a look at it, really the brainchild of this, you really went all out. You would not know where you are, other than the fact that there's windows here. <laughs> Absolutely. So what we're trying to provide here is a great sports betting experience for all different types of sports bettors. If you're a first-time customer, come down and our supervisors and our managers will show you how much fun sports betting is. They'll teach you all about it. They'll show you the ropes. If you're an experienced sports better, come down and our managers and our supervisors, they'll, te they'll show you all the FanDuel markets and what you can expect as a FanDuel customer. And for those who are who are hardcore and, you know, they like to ha be in person, you have that over at the window, but you also have all these kiosks all around us. Absolutely. So we do have five betting windows here in the main sportsbook area, uh, but we also have 26 self-service kiosks. So if you're the type of customer that, you know, sure, we offer a great experience here for the experience-seeking sports better who wants to sit, you know, have some food, watch the games, make some bets, we offer a great experience for those types of customers. But if you're the type of customer that wants to come in, just get a bed in, go home, get on with get on with your day and watch the game at home, you can do that too. All right, Jeff, thanks for giving us a look at what we can find inside here. Yeah, look and who I found woo! over here. And you know what, here's the thing, Mark, here's the thing. You gotta be 21 and over to get in, by the way. Uh, but here's the deal. Yes. Football starts tonight, Mark, yes. and yes. what a place to really get a kick on. No, exactly, and you got it all weekend. I was just looking at some of the odds right here, the Cardinals, and looking at the Suns. Kind of interesting to see what the wise guys like, what they think about our local teams. You think about the Cardinals kicking off. They only have the Cardinals at eight and a half wins this year, which I thought was That's interesting. It? That's the lowest wow. right now in the NFC West. Can't wait to see what they do against Tennessee on our sister station, CBS 5, on Sunday. Also looking at, at some bets here with the uh, Phoenix Suns. They uh -huh. have plus 1,400 to go back to the finals. Ooh, they that's have 50 nice. wins, which is good, but they don't like them to get all the way back to the finals. So interesting to see kind of what the initial thoughts are about our local teams. So Mark says he was looking at the odds. Uh, yeah. Sure, will yeah. April close April, your ears? He has a few bets. Please. Is that cool? Yeah. April, he needs an early allowance here. I know it's a Thursday. <laughs> it's not a payday Friday, but is he okay to place a bet? I, I mean, did he do the dishes? Friend. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> Did you do the dishes, she said. Uh, you know what? i got to do that. i got to cut the grass, clean the pool. Oh, well, then yeah. you can no have $20. No, okay, no, 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 no. On the Suns <laughs> nope. to get back to the finals. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's something I might bet on. Yeah. yeah that, that would be a good bet. For sure. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.